In this video, I'm gonna give you one of the best trips tight end defenses in Madden 22. Really great formation for it and a really good blitz for trips sets. Now, um, I'm specifically talking about trips tight end, play action blocking, and how we can kind of combat that. In this video, we're gonna be breaking down one of my favorite blitzes uh, in the game for trips tight end. Really simple setup actually. And uh, what we want to do is we want to, so I just got the gun trips, try to trips that enter tray. Um, if you want to get my full big nickel over G defensive guide, uh, this is the New York Giants playbook. You can also find this in the 46 playbook. Um, I would really encourage you to get it. It's the best defense all that I put together all year. It's combines every blitzing concept, every, every, everything, literally everything is in this thing and we walk you through exactly how to have the best defense in madden with this one formation now i want to teach you today a really fun little defense that you can use it's kind of a situational defense for trips tied in and uh, what we're going to do with this is you can have basin line on if you want to start i typically do and then i would really recommend uh for trips tied in in particular though we're going to run man line and auto flip on you could turn both of these off and still get the same thing basically but we're just going to do it like this and then we're just going to use the play cover one hole and again this if they're coming out in trips every single time this is a great defense to use for trips tied in so cover one hole real simple setup we're just going to show blitz and as you can see then we're going to manually um whoops i did not mean to do that i'm gonna have to throw my throw the ball away actually hit the wrong button but we're going to show blitz and then we're going to individually press the outside player so show blitz individually press circle now we have a couple of things that we can do from an adjustments perspective but i want to show the pressure real quick so we're just going to pinch our line crash our line down and then what we want to do with douglas here is we actually want to bring him down in the box and you can do a couple different things with this guy now for the pressure we're going to manually press the tight end and then really interestingly, we're going to go ahead because most of the people that run trips tight end, they will block their running back almost 80% of their scheme. Um, and we're going to take advantage of that. So they're going to block their running back. So what we're going to do is we're going to man up the middle linebacker that's guarding the running back on the tight end. We're going to blitz the outside corner on that side. And we're going to blitz the linebacker on that side as well. Now, if you don't want to blitz this linebacker, what I would recommend is bring the safety over here and then grab onto the linebacker and user him, okay? But real simple setup, and then I like to contain. Uh, what that'll do is it'll put that guy on the outside on the contain. You can stand kind of right here. You wanna make sure to pass commit. And that's pretty much it. That's literally the defense. And what you'll see here is the pressure will absolutely scream. And the really cool part about this pressure is that you're gonna be able to basically, I mean, it's gonna be real, relatively easy for you to shut down anything because you have this press on the outside. What, you, what I like to do, um, what you can do on this, um, on this, this guy right here, whoops, let me find him. This guy right here is a safety. So what you can do is you can put him in a quarter. Um, and, and one quick pro tip for big nickel over G. If you want to use, if you want to have the ability to get the standard adjustments that you would get, flick your right joystick to the left one time. That's going to give you the slot corner package. And again, cover one hole is what I like to run uh, for this defense. You can audible to this as well if you don't want to run, you know, if you don't want to just be able to show that you're a man. But anyways, um, this is a safety here. And then this actually is a safety as well. And so this, another thing that you can do with this defense is you're going to see that if I base align this defense, you see that it changed. The only thing it really changes is who's in man coverage on who. Um, so just kind of a, you know, quick little thing with that. But anyways, um, so all we're going to do is pinch RD line. You don't actually have to leave, have to run out of flip on this, but you can anyways, pinch your D line globally, bless your linebackers. And then you're going to bring this safety down. What I like to do is bring the safety down and then just kind of cross man him on the tight end. It's really good. Um, it's really, 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 really good for, um, trips tied in again my alignment's all messed up so because i audible around but just by cross baiting that safety on the tight end that's going to stop a lot of the tight end post routes because he's a he's a you know obviously a corner so simple setup here show blitz pinch line crash line down global blitz linebackers man this guy up on the tight end and then you're just going to user this guy right here 
And then the last thing that you want to do with this is you want to blitz that, that corner off of the right edge. And what you should see here is we're going to get pretty good pressure and we're going to have great coverage. Now, if you want the pressure to be a little bit more consistent um, than I'm able to get right here, what you want to do is you want to, again, that's why you want to manually press the tight end. That will walk him down just like this. And then you're going to blitz black or let your linebackers bring this guy down and just man him up on the tight end. Now with this guy right here, you can, if you want to, you can leave him here. You could also, and then you can kind of use her over here if you want. So simple. And then again, if the running back goes on a route, you're gonna guard him, but everything else is gonna be bagged and you'll see that they can't pick up the blitz. So one of my favorite defenses in the entire game. Thank you for watching the video. If you wanna get my full Big Nickel Over G defensive ebook, the link is in the description. We show you how to lock down everything in this game and also show you how to run a zone d man d match d run d all, all kinds of pressures as well so if you want to get everything the link is in the description to go join the membership it gets you access to everything for just 10 bucks you can become a patreon member and get access to all of our madden guides